Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you for joining me. Today I'm doing a plan ahead spread in my B6 using this Spring Bloom kit from Paper Muse Crafts. This is a B6 size kit. So it has a strip of washi down here and then another strip the same size down here. These are pattern tetters up here. It's only two pages. I didn't get the add-on um, for this kit and I am planning in um, week on four pages inserts from Justinia Printables. I'm going to lay down this washi from Paca Post and I will speed you through that part. I'm going to put um, the books with the pink background in the sidebar and I did white out the lines so that they wouldn't show through. I kind of want, want to cover this other line up, but I don't want to leave too much space. I'm not going to use the yellow one or because the other sidebar box is yellow. I'm excited about all the pretty spring kits that are coming out. I pulled these headers from Cozy Paper Co. Um, and I think the yellow is just going to be too bright, even though it is a very pretty yellow. I think I'm going to lay out my full boxes a little different this time. I love these colors. They just have Easter vibes. I don't think my bottom washi is going to work. 
but I'm gonna wait till I lay my full boxes out to decide for sure. And I'm gonna do a to-do list on Monday, Wednesday, Friday. These are mini drizzle dot flags from Clever Gal Crafts. I love them. And I'm gonna pull in some today scripts from Sarah Elizabeth Prince. Scripts, not prints. That looks so cute. Use these cute boxes. thought about using the little clips that came on the freebie sheet with this order because they match. See, now I'm going to lay down my full box. No. Actually, I need to call my mom's doctor. Um, I scheduled an appointment for her, and then she called behind me and rescheduled it. And so I just need to call and see what day they have her down for because it is supposed to be scheduled for Thursday of this week. And I just need to make sure that she didn't change that. I don't want to take up too much room. I'm going to pull in one of these um, arrows from the kit and a cell phone icon from Crafts by Towie. I think I'm just going to do the florals. 
I'll try to put it around the same spot. Also need to weigh in on Monday. I can use a one of these flags from the kit to mark that. Do I have three of these? would have room to mark lunch with Wendy too. I don't really have to mark lunch with Wendy anymore because I do it every Monday. I'm not going to forget. good and then Wednesday Landry has a live class connect I also have to go to Ruston on Wednesday so let me use this green arrow and I think I may pull in a car from Crafts by Towie so that'll match this car's going the wrong way um, no, this little car will be fine. So I'm going to use that to mark Rustin. And then just to keep things uniform, I hope all that wasn't off camera. I'm so sorry if it was. So that's going to be to mark lesson planning Friday. Let's see, this Friday is not payday, I don't believe. come back to that and I have one more flag that I could use down here just so that it's uniform okay I do have two of these label boxes so I'm going to do the pink one over here. That's a little crooked, but it's not too noticeable. 
to me it might be very noticeable on camera um, but from this angle it's fine that one's a little crooked too of course um, and for my team lead supervision I really want to do a a half box so that I can write in what um, what I need to talk about let me just kind of split this space and that way I can mark something above and below it and all these in my habit tracker and this script is from Wild Summer Designs I'll probably use this tracker to track my steps but the steps script I have I don't feel like will look as good in the box as this one so I'm going to pull in this important script from Rose Colored Days and I thought I pulled an Aaron script but I didn't um, Okay, I think I'm going to mark Pilates down here. I have got to increase my workouts or find some kind of diet to get on because what I'm doing is not working. Like I'll lose two or three pounds and then gain it back. And I want to put it at the top so that I can come back in and put how many minutes I do. What I want to try to do this week is to do about 10 minutes before I go to work. Um, so it's kind of like I already have some done before I get home because sometimes when I get home I'm... I'm tired or I find other things that I need to do. I was going to mark lesson planning there, which I really need to do. I can put it in the, the um, to-do list. Um, I did pull in my team lead supervision script. I'm going to put it here. Landry has a class connect at 3. And I have interviews at one. Let's see, I think I'll mark her. I know these have little snowflakes on them, but they're okay because I'm going to cover some of them up. A little planner to mark her class connect. And I know it's a planner, but it's still like book related. And since I didn't mark weighing in on Monday, I'm going to mark it over here for Tuesday, even though I'm going to weigh in on Monday. I'm going to mark it here for Tuesday. Okay. And here is a 9 o'clock. And then I'm going to do, I'll mark lesson planning for Tuesday evening. I think I'll use these cute books from the kit. This is Rustin. All right, Thursday, my mom has a doctor's appointment at 11. So let me see how I want to mark that because I am going to need to go to work first. 
oh, this is not going to be a fun day. I think I figured out a game plan for Thursday. Um, I'm going to use this bow from Nikki Plus 3. Um, I'm going to mark that um, my productivity is due and monthly reports are due. And then for my mom's doctor's appointment, I think I am going to go ahead and mark it in. Um, she also has to get lab drawn first. So the appointment's at 11, so I would say about 10.30 is when she needs to go get her lab. I know I've got an icon for doctor. Or, oh, this is perfect. There's a little syringe. Okay, I'm gonna have to pull that up though. That green is a different color green. When it's all said and done, if it still stands out like it is, um, I'll change it. So I'm just gonna mark this in here for the lab work. And this is from the Giving Girl, if I didn't say, and this is from Lux Kitty Design that I got from one of her $2 Tuesdays. And I'm sure we will go out to eat somewhere. So let me mark that with Let me see if there's any deco from the kit that I could use for that. That shoe is so dang cute that I can pull it in for the weekend. So let me just use this. and a meal icon from Crest by Tally. Right. And then Friday, I want to mark, if I haven't done it before Friday, I need to print some dashboards for um, my friend Susie. I'm gonna mark that with this little laptop from Crest by Tally. I don't have any more green headers to alternate, so I'm just going to use the patterned headers that came with the kit. Can't lay down a sticker straight to save my life. Okay, I am so sorry to have a section cut out. Um, 
I stopped to go make some hot dogs and when my camera turned off and back on, it the lighting changed. Um, it doesn't, the settings don't change, but my camera just for some reason when it cuts off and on, sometimes the lighting is completely different when it comes back on. So this washing machine, I'm going to use this to mark washing the sheets. And this is from Print Petticoat Bandit. It was a gift from my friend Susie. Thank you for those. The lesson plan script is from Wild Summer Designs. Um, the little drizzle dot flag is from Clever Gal Crafts. And that mug is from the kit. Um, I've ruined this because I tried to straighten it. And, well, I guess I laid it down before the undo was tried. <laughs> I mean, slow down. Uh, and anyway, it's wrinkled, so I may just have to replace that full box. Um, the film and Playing With Me Live script is from Letters to Apollo. This little Hobonichi planner and the washi is from GP Sticker Studio. This shoe is from the kit. I'm using that to mark a work event. I meant a, yeah, a work event. It's a party, but it's Stacy's work. People. Um, here are these. This is what I'm looking for. And I'm doing a list down here for new releases. I'll probably just use a shopping script because I don't think I have a new releases. Okay, I can't really find a full box that matches, but I did find this from Peach Palm and I thought the green would work. And I know it's gonna be a little tight fit because it's a bigger box but I think it'll be okay. And I'm gonna put one of these pans from the planning world in here. Actually, there's some deco with the kit. All right, I'm gonna do this little notebook deco right here. Just gonna put one of these hearts from Rose Colored Days. This is the Nikki Plans freebie. If you put Nikki Plans in the note to seller, and then this deco, I'm gonna put it here. Okay, I went ahead and laid them down. I came down and, and did four, and I think they look okay with it. Um, and what else was I gonna do? I have this on my tweezers, so definitely I wanna lay a couple of bows in here. Um, these are from Scribble Prints Co. They're so cute and dainty. And then I want to put a couple in this box over here. And thank you for bearing with me. As usual, I'm kind of all over the place. All right, I'm going to and this Aaron's script from Nikki Plus Three for this box. And then I will, okay, here is the final spread in the planner. Um, and the washi um, is okay. I could change it, but I think I'm just gonna leave it. It matches well enough. Um, so there's the first part of the week and the second part of the week. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I hope you have a great week. Bye.